Hi everyone. How are you today? I hope you are always healthy. Welcome back to my channel. Like always, today I'm going to show you amazing photos that will make you wonder about the advanced technology of the past. I got these photos on various telegram channels. Please check the description to know more about those channels. Some might say that I'm being repetitive by displaying these photos. But that's the whole point. These photos are proof that a small occult elite of Eastern the history to fit their narrative. Anyway, before I start, don't forget to subscribe to my backup channel, the link is also in the description box below. So, without further ado, fasten your pants and let's get started. In 79 AD, the Roman historian Josephus Flavius wrote that the last of the race of Egyptian giants did live in the 13th century BC, during the reign of King Joshua. He further wrote that they had huge bodies, and their faces were so unlike ordinary human, that it was amazing to look at them, and it was scary to listen to their loud voice which was like a lion roar. Basilisk myths date back to the Roman Empire. Pliny the Elser, in his Natural History, describes the basilisk, as does the Roman poet Lucan. Later writers would be fascinated by this earth-shattering creature, including Leonardo da Vinci, who included the basilisk in his bestiario. Mike Dash, on the Smithsonian's Future Imperfect blog, revealed an especially complete story of a basilisk hunt, repeated in Jan Bondison's The Fiji Mermaid, and other essays in Natural and Unnatural History, in which the monster was not killed by a rooster crow or weasel, but captured alive. In 1587, rumors spread of a basilisk attacking people in Warsaw. A former royal surgeon was called in to handle the case, and used a convict as his basilisk hunter. This is the famous fountain of basilisk in the Swiss city of Basel, dates back to 1884. We observe that in the past, through images in paintings, sculptures, stories, and even in passages in the Bible, reports of hybrid beings. What is the purpose of controllers attaching these beings as mythological? Take a look at this photo. This is in Notre Dame Cathedral, Paris. A bearded man with a hand axe is jazzing a cockatrice, a poisonous two-legged rooster dragon, along the top of a wall. Temple of Santiago and the Tecpatan Monastery We are told both of these structures were built in the 16th century. More specifically around the 1560s. In 1492, Columbus allegedly discovers America. By 1521, Hernan Cortes allegedly conquers Mexico. In 1560s, some group of master builder monks construct these two structures in the middle of newly discovered Mexican nowhere. We are led to believe that in 1560s, some group of rogue master builder monks produced two virtually indestructible masterpiece quality buildings, one of which is still surviving after spending over 50 years underwater. They used brick as their construction material of choice. The location they picked had no known roads available for transporting the construction materials. There must have been a multitude of Chad master builder monks back in the day if this is true. We believe these buildings were already built and abandoned by the time they were found. Only needing some minor repairs, they claim to have built them entirely in the 16th century. Before I continue the video, please give a like if you'd learn something. And, don't forget to subscribe, and also, click the notification bell too, so you won't miss any update. And, watch to the end, to avoid misunderstanding. Thank you. Taipan and its hydraulic engineering, Peru. The only Inca complex that is in perfect functioning, known as Temple of Water, the complex's canals have been flowing crystal clear water constantly for hundreds of years. This has allowed local residents to supply from this resource. Wow. 
one. An artifact that looks like a giant frying pan that was found by chance during road construction in Bantul, Indonesia. 31 August 2021. 2. There is a relief in the karma of Abhanga Wall at Barabitar Temple, Central Java. This section now has been closed and cannot be accessed anymore. The complete panel consists of three fields. The middle panel depicts people being cooked on large flaming cauldrons while giants standing next to them. The distance between the location of this discovery and Barabitar Temple is about 50 kilometers. Mermaids, enigmatic half-fish half-human entities, appear in many myths. As deities or spirits, they were ordered or feared by many cultures. The majority of them have been female, thus the moniker mermaids. Their male equivalents occur in folklore less frequently, although there were a few. The strange series of mermaid sightings off the west coast of Scotland in 1814 kindled the existence of mermaid. However, scientists generally agree, mermaid form is biologically impossible, and indicating that the legend of the mermaid is most likely a legend. Mermaids are mostly believed to be a mythological fact, with a unique feature of the human body and fishtail. This same appearance is described by many around the world, from the ancient period of time, where communication was never taken place between the countries. The Asians, Syrians, Africans, and Europeans believed them, and their civilizations consisted of the stories of a mermaid, where it was the ancient goddess of the sea according to Syrians who provide fertility, protection, and well-being for those who worship her. The Mesopotamian god of water symbolizing wisdom, creation, and magic, is a merman, and was found in the Babylonian myth. It also has crossed many other cultures, and is found in Japanese folklore and Russian folklore. Mermaid characters are brought into books, cartoons, comics, and movies. Is this because they have seen them in real? The mermaids are said to believe by some as bad luck, and so, no one ever tried going near them, or tried speaking to them. Some claim sightings of dead or living mermaids have come from different places. Some fisherman who claims to have seen mermaid, describes mermaid to be it is about 6 to 7 feet in length, has a little black head, with neck, a snow white body, and two arms. And in swimming it just appears like a human being. At times it will appear to be sighting on a sunken rock, and will wave and work its hands. There were two Canadian reports from the area of Vancouver and Victoria, one from sometime between 1870 and 1890, the other from 1967. The town of Kiryat Yam in Israel offered a reward of $1 million for anyone who could prove the existence of a mermaid off its coast, after dozens of people reported seeing a mermaid leaping out of the water like a dolphin and doing aerial tricks before returning to the depths. The existence of mermaids still holds a mystery, and a mystery yet to be solved. Even after so many experiments and researchers, although they say mermaids don't exist, it is found that 80% of the ocean is still unmapped and unexplored. So, maybe mermaids exist, and we have not yet found the existence of mermaids. Platypus is a mammal, and mammals give birth and feed milk. A platypus, although was said to be a mammal, lays eggs and feeds milk. The existence of platypus was once rejected by science, but after so many proofs, it was accepted. And similarly, although science rejects the existence of mermaids, there are probabilities of finding them in the future and accepting it. Until that, the existence of mermaids and mermen will remain a mystery. Before I end this video, let's say thank you to everyone who took the time and energy to research this. They have done a lot for us all. And thank you for watching the video until the end, I hope this information is useful for all of us. See you in the next video.